Thank you for joining me today in the unfortunate passing of the surprise onside kick. In case you didn't know, the NFL officially decided to kill off surprise onside kicks. It's hard for me to believe that he is gone. <laughs> I feel it. I just saw him yesterday. We have lots of great memories with them, whether it is the Super Bowl with the Saints, of course, surprising the Colts at halftime and winning the game, or if it's just a random game where the kicker just felt the need to start the game off with an onside kick. It was one of the most exciting things that could happen in the NFL. One of the most electric plays in football. Oh, no, She's not no, leaving. No, 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 no. But the NFL has officially killed it off. I can think of so many people I would rather have died first. We did all see it coming with the NFL making it harder and harder to do onside kicks, making it so that you couldn't load up one side of the ball, and many adjustments to the rules of kickoffs. However, many of us didn't know last year that we would see our last surprise onside kick. But I'd like us all to instead of being sad, just remember the good times. Remember the good times that you had with this play. And while many of you may get angry at the NFL, at Roger Goodell, well, you can still get angry at Roger Goodell. You can still boo him. Why did you take it from us? You're God damn you! Well, of course, we're all upset with Roger. He does have some reasons with the new crazy kickoff play that they have. It actually seems a little impossible to do an onside kick. So, the way that it is now, you can only attempt an onside kick if you are losing in the fourth quarter and you have to tell the other team. So really, it, it's just not going to happen. When it does happen, it's going to be obvious. It's not going to be nearly as fun. Knowing that an onside kick could happen at any moment was one of the best parts of the kickoff. Even though they didn't really happen very often when they did, it was great. And this kind of ends my dream of that high school coach who would always go for it on fourth down and always do onside kicks, making it to the NFL. Well, it did work out for him in high school. I guess the NFL was just too intimidated by his genius and they wanted to preemptively cancel it. Now, if you're going to listen to the NFL, they are saying there's a chance that the surprise onside kick can come back next year. This is only a temporary change. Awake? Brenda, it's George, a miracle! Stop. I thought you were dead! But I've seen enough temporary changes to know that this one is not coming back. There's just no chance. They may change it to where it's like the XFL, where you can go for it on like 4th and 15 or something like that. I don't like the idea, mainly because I could see a holding call on the defense, automatic change of the possession, and I just don't want to see penalties in this situation. I prefer old school onside kick, and I always thought the best onside kick would be just to drill it right at the first guy on the receiving team, hit him right in the helmet, have it bounce off, and I just never saw anyone try that. You know. I think maybe if Bill Belichick would have just answered one of my phone calls, they could have tried it with Vinatieri and would have the best team ever. Maybe they would have even been undefeated and beaten the Giants in the Super Bowl with that trick play of just kicking the ball straight at the other team's head. I've always thought it would work, they're just too scared to try it. And I guess it might be good for the league to actually have some people return the kicks. And it, it's exciting. It will be confusing. It will look weird, all these new kicks. But I thought we would all get together and mourn the loss of this great play. And if you're going to miss the greatest play of starting the game off with an onside kick, you should like, subscribe, and comment down below. And now... I would like to have a moment of silence for the loss of the onside kick.
if you made it to the end of this video, please leave a comment down below, and I will see you later.